What is up, my clan? Welcome back to another vlog. We got another volleyball one, but not really, because there's no volleyball actually in it. It's Sierra's volleyball banquet, end of the year banquet, and we all get a little surprise when we get there, and she gets an award. You're not gonna wanna miss that. Also, we head to the brand new Dylan's KC Barbecue uh, out in Morristown on the way to Wickenburg. It's off the 60, so you know if you guys are going from Phoenix to Vegas or Laughlin or you know heading that, that way, uh, stop by. It's really good. Great food, great atmosphere if you're into the Western country, Western uh, theme. Um, they got 12 acres, so they got tons of room, and they got tons of great ideas. Uh, Tiffany's brother is out there um, building stuff and renovating and doing all kinds of cool stuff, so uh, definitely worth checking out on the way to Wickenburg. Uh, so, hope you enjoyed the vlog. <laughs> And here we are, you guys, the brand new Dylan's KC style barbecue restaurant. Uh, I don't know the exact location, but it's basically on the way to Wickenburg. Wickenburg's just around the corner. Uh, it's old, like, rodeo country western town. It's crazy. It's first time here. We got the Bevos. We got the Mima and Papa coming. We got uh, Teresa and Ken from Texas coming. We're gonna see them because the holidays and Western Trails Ranch. Look at that. Super cool. Basketball court. Got the, got, the, got the bull riding right here. There's horseback riding back over there. This is cool, man. All while getting uh, some Kansas City style barbecue. Oh no! Guys, you should be Up on the stage here, live music plays. Overlooking basketball cornhole. Well, it's all kinds of cool stuff. They got their trailer up here. So when they work late, they can just stay the night instead of them driving home. It's about a 45 minute drive. Super cool, that's the restaurant right there. Kitchen's back over there. And they're still, they're still constructing and building stuff, and renovating, very cool. Whoa, there's two of them. There's one over there. There's one over there too. Look how, look how spiky he is. You gotta take a- take 15 years old. Take a picture and show Shelly. <laughs> show Shelly. <laughs> I like He's the He's around everywhere. He's like, he wants to know what's going on. Pretty turtle, you know? Yeah, I like the hands. It's so spiky. Oh, yeah. Cowboy Oh, yeah. Wow, man. And I pulled up my hat. This is Great job. This has got like Roman vibes on it. It's something that my grandpa would make. Especially the orange. Yeah. Family photo time. It's our whole family up here. Tiffany's whole family. But that guy on the right, right, was right on the thing. Yeah, not yet. It's they're not. They're not gonna get like that. That is Bryce's burger right there. What's it called? Big Mac. Big Mac. So you got pulled pork, mac and cheese. You got grilled cheese, smiley fries. What'd you get, Mason? Like a French dip, the Dylan's dip, yeah, yeah. Nice au jus, oh dude, horseradish, that stuff's so good. All right, we're back home uh, from Dylan's and the family outing. Really cool place, that's on, that's on the, the 60, uh, on the way out to Wickenburg. If you're on that, that area, definitely worth checking out for food or for fun. Uh, but now, we are dressed up because we have Sierra's high school volleyball banquet, end of the year banquet. So all three teams get together. Right? Yeah. All three teams are going to be there. Parents, and uh, we're eating tacos, so. <laughs> yeah. We're not that hungry, but, you know, one or two tacos, I think, would be perfect. Alright, so last but not least, um, it's our MVP award. And MVP award. So, uh, this girl basically, uh, for lack of better terms, was kind of our all around painter this year. She was very, very, very high turnout on the board and all. Um, one of our setters did an amazing job setting. Um, she actually led our team in 
with 96 assists. Um, she also led our team with 53 aces. So as she was serving, she was second on our team with 34 kills. So not only did she run a, you know, a center off of our back row, when she got front row, she was at least on the front row too, uh, to be second on our team in kills. And just all around a tremendous player. Um, and really brought stability to the fourth row. It was my honor to come to her this year and, and see how much she meant to the team and, and uh, how well she did. And that is Sierra. You guys, how awesome was that? Sierra got her team MVP award, her first high school volleyball season. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. How awesome is that? It's got her name on it, the year, like that's like a like that's like a lifetime trophy that she's gonna cherish forever because like her first volleyball season. Good job. Thank you. How you feeling? Good, great. <laughs> Good, great. Totally unexpected. Yeah. Yeah? Unexpected. <laughs> I told Tiffany, I told Tiffany they were calling the girls out. And after they got through, they started doing, because at first I was going to be like freshman, then sophomore, I'm like. Oh. I thought it was going to be number order. Number order. Manager first, yeah. And then he did one, two, three, four, and I was like, okay, I'm next. And then yeah. he started talking about Isabel, number six, and I was like. Out of order. Okay. Right, and then right. I guess he's nine, he just coincidentally did one, two, three, four first. Yeah. I had, a, I had a funny feeling though, I go, I told Tiffany, I go, he's, she's, he, he's, he's saving Sierra for last, watch. Because he started doing stats, uh, the co their coach is a real big stats guy, so he started like naming off stats and like, you know, this girl was a leader of this, and, and I was like, I know Sierra's got some, some high stats there. And... I knew I had high aces, I, I was number one on my team for aces, right. so being like, Right, but that's what I'm saying though. Like I had a feeling that you were gonna be last because of the stats. Yeah, that's, that's why too. we did not know no, they did MVP I awards. Did, yeah. So yeah. super cool. You got a keychain. Yeah. Little keychain with her name and the year and the. Let's see if I can get the focus. There it is. Oh, perfect. Yeah, real cute. So all the girls got that mm -hmm. and a certificate. And yeah. then there were three awards. There was, was most, most improved. Most improved Viper award. Which is like all around, just all around, like player of the year. Like uh, attitude. Yeah. Even if like they had didn't like if they weren't as skilled. Yeah. They had like the best attitude, best all around right. player. And then MVP. And then MVP. Yeah, girl. Well, there you go, guys. Uh, as you saw, Sierra got the MVP award for her first season of volleyball first high school season of volleyball um pretty proud of her like i don't know what to say like she's amazing as you guys know like i'm a big fan of my daughter and she just continues to do amazing things and i told her though i said you just hit the bar pretty high <laughs> your freshman year getting the mvp award you got three more years of high school um but uh you know we're very excited we're very proud of her and it was a great, great volleyball season. And we're looking forward to, you know, three more great seasons of high school volleyball. Um, but first, we have Club. As you saw in the last vlog, she made the 15s open uh, team with AZ Epic. And so the, the practices start up this coming week. And her first tournament is in December. And the season kicks off in January. So very much looking forward to, uh, you know, club volleyball season. It's always a good time. And that's gonna be a little different this year. I don't know if I mentioned it in the last vlog, but her games are gonna actually be on Sundays. Her tournaments are gonna be on Sundays, uh, which is different, but good, because that means we'll never miss Bryce's basketball games or the basketball tournaments when he has those, because uh, they won't be conflicting. But it also means that's our weekend. If Bryce has basketball and Sierra has volleyball, that's our weekend, so we'll see. But anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, thumbs up, and we'll see you in the next one. Vlog on.